was close. Paimon almost got blown away. Luckily, Paimon managed to grab hold of your hair. Thanks. Just what was that? Paimon thought we were gonna get eaten. Hmm. It definitely has something to do with that weirdo who was talking to the dragon. Yeah, Paimon gets why you're worried. Oh, what's that? There's some kind of shiny red thingy on the big rock over there. Let's go take a closer look. Be careful. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. All Paimon knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. God protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Doesn't sound like a local name to me. And this mascot, what's the deal with it? I mean, we've only been traveling partners for two months, but we've already become the very best of friends. So to sum it up, you're traveling partners, right? Well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. I give you my apologies, uh, strange yet respectable travelers. That sounded so fake! Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? Suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? She got separated from her brother during a really, really long journey. Paimon is her travel buddy, helping her to find her brother. Oh, looking for your family? Huh. Uh... Okay, let me finish my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in a bit. Quick, get it! 
monsters have been getting too close to the city recently. My task this time is to clear out their camp. a little with your moves there. Thanks for the backup. How'd it feel? Now that you mention it, how is it the hilly trails ended up here? These creatures don't seem like the type to set up camps so close to cities like this. Exactly. It's more normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness. But because the dragon, Storm Terror, has been around a lot more recently, our orchards have been destroyed, and the local market has been affected as well. When the storms hit, we usually end up with at least a few injuries, so the Knights of Favonius have been tied up doing the best they can to defend the area. So these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer to the city? Exactly. That said, clearing this camp helped make the area a little bit safer. Come with me! A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Opening a chest is like a unwrapping a gift. win
I can't go back to Gloria like this. Will come in handy. <sighs> That's more like it. I'd win. Should I cook next? Oh, are you travelers from around here as well? No, we just happen to be passing by. What are you cooking? Smells good! I see. Welcome, travelers. I'm Lynn, the survival expert of the Adventurers Guild. As you can see, I'm experimenting with some new recipes. Eat before you go. The first rule in the Wilderness Survival Guide. Picnic? Oh, Paimon just loves picnics! My travel partner here is good at cooking as well. That's okay. Let's see what you can do. You won't get a lot of chances like this to learn from a survival expert. There are some mushrooms and meat in the barrel over there. Try making a chicken mushroom skewer for me.
Is it done? Let me try. Hmm. Uh, Uh-oh. Now that's really tasty. You are indeed gifted. Paimon told you so. With your culinary skills, you should try more difficult dishes. Oh, I've got some raw ingredients in my bag. Have them in return for this meal. Can we really have them? Won't you run out of ingredients? That's okay. You should be able to find lots of ingredients when exploring the wilderness. Don't forget to look carefully. There's also a restaurant in Mondstadt known as Good Hunter that sells food and ingredients. Go have a look when you've got the time. Okay, thank you for the info. <gasps> hey, leave some chicken mushroom skewers for Paimon! <laughs> You can't keep up with me! Introduce the city of wind, dandelions, and freedom. Travelers under the protection of the Knights of Havonius, welcome to Mondstadt. Finally, no more having to camp outdoors. But the city folk don't look too cheery. Everyone's been put out of place by storm terror recently. But everything will turn out fine as long as Jean's with us. Jean? Acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. Jean, with Jean on our side, surely even the vicious storm tear. Before I take you guys to the Knights of Favonius headquarters, I have a present for you, Traveler. It's a reward for helping me clear out that Hillitrol camp. H hey! Why doesn't Paimon get a reward? Uh, because this reward is useless to you, Paimon. But I'll treat you to a traditional Mondstadt delicacy. Sticky Honey Roast! Sticky Honey Roast! Come with me. We'll head to the city's, uh, high ground. used to be a bustling street. Except for the local tavern near the city wall over there, they haven't been affected. If anything, their business is better than ever.
to give you is a wind glider outriders use them to ride the wind and the people of Mondstadt love using them too I brought you here to give it to you so you can experience it right away oh you're really excited about these wind gliders huh well that's because the wind is the heart and soul of Mondstadt oh. alrighty then enough talk let's give it a whirl it's easy to use, but you still need to pay attention to my instructions. I wonder what it's like. got the power to go up against the dragon. Are you a new ally? Or a new storm? Storm Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself! Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right time. We must... Hold on, Amber. 
Are you perhaps forgetting to introduce us? Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry captain. These two are travelers from afar. From afar? Is that all we know of them? Uh, long story short... I see. Welcome to Mondstadt. Uh, though you haven't arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. I understand the anguish of being separated from family. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the Animo God. Oh, but everyone has their secrets, right? <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend our thanks to you for your help just now. Ah, how about a traditional Mondstadt delicacy? St your fight to defend the city against the dragon just now was witnessed by no small number of citizens. The acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius is also very interested in meeting you, and... the Knights of Favonius headquarters. Let's head in. Agreed to meet them here. There have been sightings of storm terror outside the city. Once we meet, we must... Relax. I'll lend a hand when the time comes. Jean, I've brought them. <laughs> and once it was over, I brought them straight here. Mondstadt welcomes you, Windborn Travelers. I am Jean, acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. This is Lisa, our resident librarian. <laughs> oh, are you sweeties here to help us out? <laughs> You're both so adorable. Sadly, the timing is regrettable. Storm Terror has caused quite a ruckus in the region since its recent resurgence. Simply put, Mondstadt's elemental sphere and ley lines aren't... For a mage, it couldn't get much worse. My skin is one elemental particle away from a full-blown breakout. <sighs> if it weren't for this interference, the Knights of Favonius would have better ways to help you than just putting up missing person posters. We simply ask that you repose in Mondstadt while we help you seek out your brother. Paimon will help too. Good. In that case, we need a plan. With Storm Terror now directly attacking Mondstadt, we may have an opportunity. Lisa has revealed the sources of Storm Terror's power with her detection magic. Is that so? They're located in the abandoned Four Winds Temples. 
Storm Terror's ability to whip up these kinds of storms can be attributed to it drawing power from the temples. Our objective is to deal with three of the four temples. I trust everyone understands why we are only dealing with three. Paimon doesn't. Knights of Favonius, time is against us. The storm is rampant. There is no point in maintaining a defensive position. All right, we need to take initiative and act before the situation escalates. From now on, the adventures will probably get more and more dangerous. We should make sure we're prepared. We could start by going to Mondstadt's blacksmith. Over there. Take your pick. Or if you need something else, I can make it on request. Wow! He just bespoke weaponry? Of course! I sell weapons, make them to order, and do refinements. All in the job description for a blacksmith. All you need is the ore. No, buy from someone else. I barely have enough for myself. <sighs> you look confused. Listen, I'll tell you where the Mira's deposits are. Bring some back and I'll help you forge what you need. No need. I have other things to do. He seems like a short-tempered guy. Was it something Take he said? Pick. You'll find no second-rate items at Wagner's.
This is it. One of the deserted temples of the Four Winds. These temples have been left to waste for years now. The people of Mondstadt almost never come here. There's a chance there's a monster nest or hillatrol camp inside. <sighs> Even Storm Terror has given up on its own temple. Yes. I also find it hard to accept, but... Storm Terror was once one of the Four Winds. Huh? Wait! Did you just feel that? The wind here. Something's off. Let's go in and take a look. Be careful. The dragon's power is disturbing this area. You can use that console to open the door. Wow, I can see so far into the temple. Prepared. 
unlock my secret weapon, Explosive Puppet Buried Bunny! barrels over there? Well, one shot should be able to blow them up! Breath. Is that where the power is coming from? Great, let's smash it. Phew, I'm tired. But at least this way we've helped Jean out. In the past, we were at least able to defend the city and keep it safe. This, of course, is mostly thanks to Jean. But now with Storm Terror directly attacking the city itself, the winds change, so too should our tactics. It's what Lisa likes to say. Speaking of which, the four winds we were discussing earlier? 
If you want to learn more about our history, you can ask Lisa. I'm not saying I don't know our history. It's just... I mean, a librarian is supposed to be more knowledgeable.